Good evening. The state television company Western Armenia represents the most important events of these days. Today's broadcast. The Armenian cave church in Gesari was destroyed by thieves. The clear waterfall of Van is frozen. The 27th Armand Engineering Laboratory opens in Artsakh. The foreign minister of the Netherlands will visit Armenia. The Armenian Church of the Holy Mother of God in Gesaria, Western Armenia has repeatedly been and continues to be destroyed by treasure seekers. As a result of the attacks, the church was significantly destroyed. In particular, the frescoes on the walls were damaged because of the cracks in them. In an interview with Turkish media, village mayor Omer Nalband noted that the state of the church is very sad for them, expressing hope that the authorities will repair it and make it the tourist destination. Representatives of the Gesaria State Department of Culture and Tourism mentioned that all churches in the state are registered. Some works are being planned, however, there are no exact dates. Because of the cold weather in Van, province of Western Armenia, the Berkri waterfall has been frozen. Local and foreign visitors who come to see the waterfall enjoy the beautiful view and take pictures. Roads in 75 settlements have been closed because of the snowstorm in Van last week. In a region where temperatures are low, snowfall continues to have a negative impact. On January 21, an opening ceremony of Armad Engineering Laboratory took place at Stepanakert No. 8 Secondary School at the Initiative of Union of Information Technology Enterprises, sponsored by Danna Asfad Zaturian, who survived Baku massacres. According to the Nartsakh Press reporter, the school students welcomed Ashad Gulian, Speaker of the National Assembly of the Republic of Artsakh, Minister of Education, Science and Sport Narine Agabalian, Minister of Foreign Affairs Masi Ismailian. Then they placed flowers to the memorial plaque commemorating the victory. Victims. Armat Engineering Laboratories will play an important role in the economic field of the Republic of Artsakh by preparing a technical workforce that will meet the growing demand. On January 22, Minister of Foreign Affairs of the Kingdom of the Netherlands, Stef Bloch, will be in Armenia on an official visit. As reports the Minister of the Foreign Affairs of Armenia on January 23, the Foreign Ministers of the Republic of Armenia and the Kingdom of the Netherlands will meet and give a joint press conference at the Ministry of Foreign Affairs. During the visit, Minister of Foreign Affairs of the Kingdom of the Netherlands, Stef Bloch, will be received by Prime Minister Nikol Pashinyan. Minister Bloch will also visit the Genocide Against Armenia's Memorial Complex and pay tribute to the holy martyrs. Now let us represent to your attention a song by Karin. You can find the whole version of the song in the official page of Western Armenia TV. This was all for today. Goodbye.